I found out through the uh, emergency LSU text message services, um, and then I was contacted by my uh, supervisors. How, how long after uh, you got the text message did your supervisors contact you? Um, fairly quickly, within five minutes, just so that they could contact their supervisors. Um, it, it all went fairly smoothly for the first bit, that if they have a, if they have a ride, to calmly go off campus, and if not, then we were setting up a shelter in the basement. Um, and, uh, yes, I am worried, but I have uh, a good bit of faith in LSU PD, and so I, I feel like this will be resolved. Whenever we were first asked to stay inside the building in the basement and then move outside, and really the only hiccup was that the residents weren't happy about they had gotten set up in the basement and they were they were ready to do homework and have fun and just ride out the storm kind of like how Hurricane Isaac happened and then and then we were asked them to move outside where they can't really do anything besides just stand around and talk and wave in the incident of emergency um, protocol they are not allowed to tell us beforehand once we are on the bus we will be notified of where we will be taken. Um, this is because of the precaution of ongoing threats, possibly at the next location of where the buses are headed. That's why they haven't released that information yet. In the, uh, in the residence education system, the RAs are kind of at the base. We're kind of like the information gatherers. Above us, we have a graduate student who works in coordination with the professional and the professional staff that is housed in Grace King, and they all set the chain of command up and down and so the efficiency is fairly decent because we've established especially with technology now that you can quickly send out information through either emails or group messages